Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This time I'm very itchy backside, so I already got one uh, the entry level of uh, coffee machine because it is the most bought in Shopee. I decided to buy another unit to try it out and share with everyone that uh, because not only the price is cheap but the delivery is extremely fast and all the way from China I bought this at about 290 ringgit from Lazada Lazada usually will have extra discount if you guys are waiting to buy certain things look for 1111 I am definitely sure this unit will fall below 290 ringgit including free shipping the unit that I buy is already 290 including free shipping and this is Petrus Petrus is actually I found out that it's a brand under Xiaomi so it's quite interesting that you know like uh, it comes in green color and I'm keen to check this out let's do the unboxing this is well packed really well packed and all the way from China it only takes six days to reach my home from the day I purchased so it's extremely fast which I'm very very surprised usually seven to ten days but this is six days and there are the box it seems like uh, already open so i believe they are opening for testing you see like uh, you can see like uh, that here is already open so i believe they have opened up for testing let's see what's in the box so it's in a big box and they have another box in there I'm not too sure about my machine right now because it seems like the box is damaged then it's like uh, there's a damage in here also so there's a damage over here so I'm not too sure how does this machine is right now I like the code of this machine because it puts every drips makes sense I don't know what doesn't make sense but seems Every trip it makes sense, let's do it. This is the machine. Aya. They give a free plug, which is a three point plug. And one very good thing about it is uh, the international adapter. So they give a free one piece for it because in the actual unit is like this so what we need to do is just like a plug it in plug it in so we got a whole piece don't have to buy one so this is a bit metal then this is plastic you just need to put it in and then it comes with the the photo filter like my the other coffee machine set it comes with the photo filter this is longer than the one that I have and it seems like more solid also it's more heavy the only difference compared to my the other machine is that this one it doesn't have a lock so it's like you just put it in anytime then I can just take it off like that so for you it doesn't have the little lock over here will be just take this out if you want to throw away your coffee this is how you lock it then when you want you hold on that then that's where you hit so the whole thing doesn't fall down so this is like the machine it's very light then they have the this is the frothing machine here is off here is full so i believe it's turned all the way to the end oh it's like 360 degrees so ooh. okay so it's off over here you turn all the way go on 360 degree but they have a maximum over here to not push beyond that so i guess it's like that we'll have to try it out they come with uh, the measuring spoon and the tempering so this is like two in one so you can take your coffee powder pour it over here then you tamp on it like that 
Averagely on my other machine, I use about 12 to 14 gram of coffee powder. So it really depends on your taste. After I played a around a lot in my X machine, or not my X machine, it's my current machine that I've been using a lot. So I am using about 16. But here, the return over here is 16 gram of coffee. 16 gram of coffee, we just put it in. I think that also depends on your own preference. 14 is quite decent. I think 16 is perfect. Like many other, a lot of cafe, they use about 16 to 16, 18 or 22 gram kind of coffee. So it really depends on your own taste. This machine comes in only one color and it's very straightforward. The only thing over here is like left or right. That's all for a dummy series. Then they have on off button over here. Okay or not okay. I believe I don't know what's that. Then if you turn it to the right, that's the steamer. So if you want to brew your espresso, turn it to left. So that's where the espresso extract coming out. If you're not, after you're done, you need to do it. You push it to the right, then that's where you get your frothing. There is an on off button over here. So on and off. One good thing about this machine is they come with a metal top. This is where the heater is. So usually what I do is oops. Usually what I do is I can put my item here like that. Or you can put your glass on the top. This is where you put all your coffee glass. Like cafe, many cafe they put all their glass on top. You can follow the same thing also. So for frothing. It's a very very big ass kind of frothing so I'm not too sure will this kind of uh, frothing will give you a good one but in my X machine I am learning it can be taken in off so it's the same this is a fat ass and this is a smaller one so I will be trying to do froth with this in two versions one with the big fat item and the other one is with the smaller one but the smaller one I think will be a big challenge because it's so short so I'm not too sure how can we do a nice prop like this. So I will have to see what are the tips available in YouTube and I'll share with every one of you. Another machine that I have is the back. The water tank is just right behind, you just slide it in. But for this machine, it is on the side. You just pull it out. And it seems like they have stain. I'm not too sure whether they have they tested out, but then the stain is here. Then the the water pipe. You just need to pull this off to make sure that the water goes in. So this is like the start to oh. Actually, you don't need to pull it off because it has a hole in there. So there's a purpose for this. So we shall maintain that. So this is a water tank and you can just slot it in Thanks. So this is just a brief introduction of the machine and let's move next on to do espresso and to do frothing. Thanks for watching, like, click, subscribe, comment, 
whatever you guys need. And thank you. See you guys in my next episode. See ya.